great deal of ground from the other drivers, almost a lap behind the uh, giving everything to that Tirana. Third posi second position is uh, Peter Midson, Stephen Harrington challenging that Tirana for third position. And as they go up Roadways Hill, uh, things are uh, happening behind them from uh, just inside the right wheel of his car. And he may have some cooling problems. Gowans has been able to overtake Leon Burton in the Celica and uh, is closing rapidly on the slower cars ahead of him. Bruce Gowans throws the Celica through Hadley's corner. He will get back to second gear in the five-speed gearbox of the uh, powerful Celica V8 down through the S's accelerates hard then brakes extremely hard before turning and uh, applying all the power that he can muster from that V8 engine there Ray Mead is about to be engulfed at great speed by Bruce Downs slower. Bruce Gowans is a variance uh, getting close to the uh, other cars. Peter Midson there being slipped inside by Darrell Wilcox. Now it's Wilcox who moves up a position as they get down through into the S's. Alan Welling ahead, Midson behind, Hurd next. Hurd has his mirrors full of the Gowans Salika V8 and uh, Kerry Bailey is tucking in just behind the Salika as well. But up the hill there's not much room. Peter Midson has Hurd go past on the left, Gowan's going past on the right. In the uh, early model Falcon, uh, early model Holden, powered by Falcon, filling his mirrors, and uh, back behind them, Warwick Ray, Wilcox, Gowan's, and Boyd are uh, all there. The slower escort being passed quite rapidly by the V8 Salika. Wilcox in behind them, getting a tow, but traffic problems have been too great for the. Salika.